When we look at back up, hopefully it stays there. Welcome to me reading the Bible. Um, tis raining. Today we go over chapter 10 of Revelations. I really like the chapter. The angel and the little squirrel. Then I saw another mighty angel come down from heaven. He was robed in a cloud with a rainbow above his head. <coughs> his face was like the sun, and his legs were like fiery pillars. He was holding a little squirrel, which laid open in his hand. He planted his right foot on the sea, and his left foot on the land, <coughs> and he gave a loud shout, like the roar of a lion, when he shouted, The voices of the seven thunders spoke. And when the seven thunders spoke, I was about to write, but I heard a voice from heaven say, <coughs> Seal up what the seven thunders have said, and do not write it down. Then the angel I had seen standing on the sea, and on the land raised his right hand to heaven and he swore by him who lives on who lives forever and ever <coughs> who created the heavens and all that is in them and no no and and all that is in them the earth and all that is in it and the sea and all that is in it and said <coughs> There will be no more delay, but in the days when the seven angels, no, but in the day when the seven angel is about to sound the, sound his trumpet, the mystery of God will be accomplished, just as he announced to his servants, the prophets, <coughs> Then the voice that I heard, then the voice that I had heard from heaven spoke to me once more, Go take as a scroll that lies open in the hand of the angel who is standing on the sea and on the land. So I went to the angel and asked him to give me the little scroll, and he said, Take it and eat it. It will turn your stomach sour, sour, but in your mouth it will be as sweet as honey. <coughs> that is Ezekiel chapter 3, verse 3. <coughs> it's a little reference there. <coughs> I took this little scroll from the angel's hand and ate it. It tasted, uh, tasted as sweet as honey in my mouth, but when I had eaten it, my stomach turned sour. sour. Then I was told, you must prophesy again about many peoples, nations, languages, and kings. <coughs> 